Falcons, Redskins, rainy conditions here at kickoff, and the rain should continue throughout the day. Phil, as a quarterback, these conditions, the rain, how much will it affect the play here? You don't mind rain, Jim. You can throw and catch in the rain, but when it's raining this hard, there is nothing you can do to these footballs. They are going to be hard to handle, heavy, slick. There is going to be some turnover. And he's taken down right at about the 29, not quite to the 30. First down, offense readying for the snap. Keeps it here. Airing it out. Oh, and almost picked off that time. Here's a look at the Redskins offense. A week ago, they leaned on the running game as they rushed for over 200 yards. Second down following that incompletion. The Redskins lined up. Everybody split out wide. Wilson's going to pull in the bullet pass. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Wilson's in the slot, not in the backfield for this play. Wilson on the screen. Greeny's in on the tackle. And here's the Falcons' defensive lineup. Their strength right up front. Their ability to stop the run currently in the top 10 in the league. Second down coming up. RG3 has it under center. Just a quick drop back. Greeny brings the quarterback down. This defense is ready to pounce here early in this game as a third and long play is coming up. They sure are. There's no doubt about that. They got themselves in a good situation here. If I'm the quarterback now, third long, I would be very cautious and conservative. Heading to the line for a third down play, and this was something they specialized in last week, converting in these situations. Third and a long way to go, eyeing that left side. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Boy, that was a promising drive for quite a while, and finally the defense steps up. Yeah, the defense stepped up, but also, boy, that was a uninspired play call, I thought, on third down. Didn't give the offense a chance, and the defense took advantage of it. for error here with the offense. The Falcons are at the line of scrimmage with their backfield loaded up, brought down after a gain of six. Second and four following the run. Matt Ryan under center. Here's the handoff. They got him behind the line of scrimmage. Here's our look 
Yes, the Falcons offense. They rank towards the middle of the pack in passing offense this season. Let's see what they do on this third down situation. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Corners formation here for the defense. A near interception that time by Merriweather. The defense did an awesome job that time. They had the right defense calls, and that time the defender almost picked off the pass. Good job by the defense. Wilson's going to look for space now. They bring him to the turf. They face first down. Garcon's lined up now as a slot receiver. Garcon has it on the screen. That's a gain of six. You can do all you want on the defensive side. You can give a lot of looks, but it's just too easy for the quarterbacks and receivers to throw again. That leads us to second down. Garcon's lined up in the slot. Gets the handle here. And Morris is met after a gain of three. Morris is a dangerous runner when you give him room to run, but there is no room this time. What a job by the defense. They bottle him up for a short game. Third down on the way. The Redskins come out. Two tight ends on the field. Young's handed the football. Good for only a yard. That is a nice job by the running back there. He knew it was third and short, so he put that big old body up in there and grinds out the first down. First down here after the run. Griffin's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. He's looking to the right here on this throw. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. That's a good job by the quarterback recognizing it's man-to-man -man defense. And when you see that, just watch the receiver leading to the open space. Nice completion. Morris is lined up as the single back. Griffin's dropping back to throw once again, and he hauls it in. Brought down after a gain of 15. You got to be able to adjust when you run these drag routes across the field. The throw cannot always be right on target. Can you reach behind, make the catch, and keep going full speed? That's the sign of a good receiver. inside the red zone. They were very good at finishing off drives last week in this situation. First down at the 16. Handoff by Griffin. Brought down just two yards shy of the first down marker. The Redskins have really been dominant today on the offensive side. In the red zone now, they just take the football and they run it right at the defense and pick up solid yards. And now they'll try over again on second down. Offense lines up here. Gives it to him again. Maybe fine. The offense is so close right here. They just need to show a little power and punch this in the end zone and get that touchdown. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Play clock's running down. And Morris is take, takes it across, and he's in for the touchdown. Now we bet first and goal that the offense, about 90% of the time, 
is going to run the football. And what do they do here? They run it and they get it done. That is power football at its best. The Falcons in kick return formation. And no return as this goes for a touchback. First down here. Matt Ryan under center. Play action fake. Looking to throw. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, I know this feeling. When a blitzer's coming, nobody's there to block him. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. It's now second down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Corners formation here for the defense. Ryan's pass will be incomplete this time. Well, doesn't get much worse than this, does it? You're losing the football game. Now you're looking at third and long. And look, there are no miracles in the NFL. I'll tell you that. So be smart. If the play is not there, don't force it. Dump it off and wait for the next time you get it. He'll throw it over the middle. Ryan over to Jones. They'll mark him at the 41. I'm sure the head coach was over on the sideline that time thinking about sending his punt team out there. Didn't even realize his team. What a job by them on the offensive side. Picking up that first down on third and long. After the long game, let's see what they do here. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. That brings the play to an end. Gerhardt's never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. Falcons have it at the 44. Incomplete. Lots of ways to attack cover two. There's no doubt about it. You can throw it underneath. You can pump fake the safeties, make one of them move, and still throw it deep down the field. Matt Ryan under center. Third and seven. Catch made. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Nice job that time by the defense, knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. Better be careful here. Terrible starting field position here for the offense. Wide receivers are bunched up. The quarterback motions the wide receiver. First down and 10. And Morris has got it on the handoff. And gains maybe four. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Second down. Griffin, play action, throws to the right. On the money. How do you stop these wide receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up. They make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. First down here after the completion. Offense lines up here. 